And then once they say whatever there, the, here's the transition. I got you, well look, I don't wanna take up too much of your time. That's the transition, you gotta stick. I got you, well look, I don't wanna take up too much of your time. This is what I believe. I'm sharing that with you for nothing. Just get out there and succeed. All right, cool, William. William, let's let you be the property owner and I'm the agent, right? All right. All right, ring, ring, ring. Hello? Hey, Mr. Patrick. Oh uh, yeah? Hey, Mr. Patrick, Ricky Carruth down here at EXP Realty in Gulf Shores. How you doing today? I'm all right, man. How are you doing? Cool, man. Yeah, I'm enjoying the day, bro. It is gorgeous out here, isn't it? Yeah, it's a, it's a nice day. Yeah. Look, I don't want to take up too much of your time, but there was a house right around the corner from you that just sold. Didn't know if there was anything in the world I could do for you. Like what? Well, <laughs> well, like I said, I, uh, I'm with EXP Realty, you know, like buying or selling a piece of property. Oh, okay. I got you, man. Um, no, I think we're all set right now. Cool, cool. Is there an agent you would work with if you were to do something? Uh, you know, not, not really. I'm not looking to do anything right now, so. Cool, gotcha, gotcha. Well, look, I'm sure at some point in the future, you're gonna do something at some point, right? Uh, I mean, yeah, eventually. Yeah, uh, well, man, I would love the opportunity to work with you when that day comes. Would it be hard if I just stayed in touch with you? Oh, uh, sure, I don't see why not. Cool, man, what's a good email for you? Uh, WilliamPatrick at EXPRealty.com. Cool, is this your sale number? Uh, sure is. Cool, man. Well, look, I'll, I'll stay in touch with you via email. Again, this is Ricky Carruth at EXP Realty. And uh, if there's ever anything I could do for you, just let me know. Will do, man. Appreciate it. Have a good day. One thing I want to emphasize here is the transition points. Okay, the transition points from when they say they're doing okay, I ask them about the weather. Maybe I don't talk about the weather. Maybe it's about, you know, a sports team or maybe it's about a holiday or something to break it up where it's not... Um, it's not just a sales call. We're going straight into sales. We want to we want to loosen them up. And then once they say whatever there, the, here's the transition. I got you. Well, look, I don't want to take up too much of your time. That's the transition. You got to stick. I got you. Well, look, I don't want to take up too much of your time. But the reason for the call, I listed a property. I sold a property. Property sold around the corner. I see your house for sale by owner. I see your property expired off the market. Whatever you're calling about. And I didn't know if there's anything in the world I could do for you today. A lot of times they might ask for more information on the sale or something like that. You'll go through that motion at the end of the day. You know, if they want to do a deal, great. Let's see if they have an agent they're working with on that and help them do that. If not, hey, is there an agent? Here's the next transition. Hey, is there an agent? Here's the next transition. They're not ready to do anything. Here's the next transition, right? This is the most important right here. When they say they're not ready to do anything, you cannot hesitate. The transition has to be stuck and you have to say, I got you, well is there an agent you would work with if you were to do something? Boom, okay, boom. Cool, well look, I'm sure you'll do, you're gonna do something at some point. I would love the opportunity to work with you when that day comes. Would it be all right if I just stayed in touch? Now look at how I asked for the email address. I didn't say, do you have an email address? Or what's your email address? Or I'm gonna send you a market report. Or I'm gonna do this, or I'm gonna do that. No, I said, would it be all right if I stayed in touch with you? And then you pause and let them answer. You're setting them up. And when they say yes, when they say yes, then you ask for the email. Great, what's a good email for you? Boom, this is gold.